Welcome the latest announcement of the uh, new ESCOM CEO and board members of South African Express. Public Enterprises Minister Praveen Godan confirmed the appointment of Pakamani Khadebe as ESCOM CEO and eight new board members at SA Express. The developments come as SA Express has been grounded due to serious cases of non-compliance that pose serious safety risks. Opposition parties say this step is long overdue. The majority of parastatals have been bankrupted by serious instances of mismanagement and corruption. Although opposition parties have generally welcomed Gordon's announcement, others expressed concern about politically connected individuals on these new boards. We don't believe it's going to be an easy task for all these boards and uh, for Pagamani uh, in ESCOM and all the other boards to turn them around. It's like turning the Titanic around. But if they can get at it slowly, I'm sure that uh, in the medium term, we will have well-running, efficient SOEs. Massive changes at SA Express. I must, though, reiterate that we are very concerned about uh, Mr. Lamula's appointment for the very same reasons uh, as we were when he was at the Media Diversity Agency. And that is because of the conflict of interest, um, him being a, a chairperson and, and an NEC member of the ANC. I do think that that plays into this CADA deployment issue that we've had at the in the past with SOEs and uh, certainly we were hoping for a break of this political appointment. But Gordon defended some of these appointments saying they were unmarried. Now Mr. Lamola has been chosen because he's been practicing corporate law for the last 10 years. He runs his own company. Um, he's got a master's in corporate law and I think another master's as well. So he's not somebody uh, who's not a professional. And what we've done in many of the boards, is, uh, on all the boards, is try to get a gender balance right, uh, try to get the balance between experienced and younger people right, give new opportunities to young professionals, lawyers, accountants, engineers, uh, so that another generation uh, of board members can actually uh, learn from the more experienced ones. Gordon also announced that the new CFO at ESCOM would be announced soon. Other changes have been made to the boards of Transnet and Tenel. Manilis Tubase, SABC News, Parliament.